Hi everyone, Steph here from Old Guy Melts Plastic. Um, wanted to do another quick test with some fans to see if there's any visual difference in the amount of water displacement um, when the fans are placed at the same height above the glass of uh, mostly full of water. Um, so I've got three fans here. I've got a Winsin 4010 blower fan. I have a GDS Time over here. Uh, 4010 blower fan and I have the uh, Honey Badger 4010 blower fan and I'm just curious to see if there's any visual difference um, I don't have you know airflow tools to be able to measure that properly scientifically but uh, subjective tests still have some relevant value so um, so I'm just simply going to hold the each fan um, at the height of the glass here above the, the glass of water and we'll see if um, there's any noticeable difference in the amount of uh, turbulence that's created in the water below. All right, so without any further ado, let's start with the Winsin fan, which uh, we'll see how that does. Now, I'm going to try and suspend it just above the surface of the glass, right about there. And I'll do my best to hold the other two fans at the same position. So that's what it looks like with the wind sand, and this is blowing at 100%. Alright, so let's move on to the GDS time fan next. So with the GDS time fan, a uh, noticeable difference in water displacement, so um, I would argue that that's um, an indicator of you know a higher um, cubic feet per meter or airflow, um, cubic feet per minute rather, not meter, it would be a wrong uh, combination of units of measurement there, my apologies. Um, I'm a little tired, it's late here where I am, so, uh, so yeah, that definitely looks better to me, more airflow. Let's see what the Honey Badger looks like by comparison. So again, here we have the Honey Badger fan. And... No, that, that's close. It's hard to say between the GDS Time and the Honey Badger, but I think I might give the edge to the Honey Badger here. Again, totally non-empirical and subjective testing, but um, yeah, that is that is really close. Let me just put the GDS time back again to see. Sorry, yeah, I don't know, that's too close to call for me. Uh, I still think the Honey Badgers are probably getting a bit of an edge there for sure. Um, so yeah, just like I said, checking to see what that looks like and uh, you know, that would be some indicator at least of different levels of airflow um, between the fans. So thanks very much for watching. Um, if you like what you see, subscribe and uh, comment in the post below.